Good afternoon, it's um, Thursday the 10th of October. I'm a lady asked me would I show her, you know how to use the back and seal things, how do I do them? So I'm trying to do this video that way because I know it fills you full television screen, look at Jesus looking over me. It fills you full tennis, television screen. So. I might go out of sight with it because I'm trying to do it, trying to show you. So bear, bear with me, bear with me. Um, I bought these. Just show you. I bought these today. They, they are um, Chinese chicken portions. I got them. So there's obviously too many there, so I'm going to, I have got these bags, bought these bags already pre-cut on that, off it. <clears throat> I'm going to stand right up here for you to see me. I bought these bags. <clears throat> off to me with that. <clears throat> I'm just going to show you, these are already pre-cut. And the seals on one end, but I also like these. You get this in a row, and what I do is I get get one end and I seal it. I'll show you. I just push this down. You have to push both sides down, and then it has it has a button that says seal. So I do hope that you, you're seeing this. When that flashes three times, it means it's finished. But then I have to put you back down a minute. And then open it. And it's sealed. See? Can you see that? It's sealed right across. So you cut that to whatever length you want. Or you can do this. I'll show you what I've done out in these. What I've done. Here's some I prepared earlier. I'll show you if I can get them on with the screw what I've done. No. No, it's not there. With them bags, what I got, what I did, I put food in the bottom of it, then I put that on top and I sealed it so I still had all this that I could put more food, but you can't fill it right to the top, you've got to leave about that much space. So, see these, this is off bags that I've cut out of this. I cut the size and then what people think well how did you do that with the uh, the food and that I'll show you now with one I prepared earlier this is um, <clears throat> I'll just put that back in the freezer I don't need it pea soup and everything in there, lentil soup. What I do is, I'll show you in a minute. I push all the soup, when I've poured it in, when I've got a big spoon and the bag's open, I put about four or five big uh, serving spoons in because I know that's enough to fill a little bowl without overeating. Then I push it all down like that push it all down and then I put it on I put it on here while the soup's all down at the bottom I hold it down so the soup stays away and then I seal it and then when it's done I'll flatten it out like that and I'll freeze it and stack them that's for me tea later but see I've wrote on a pea and ham soup. That's for me tea later. 
I'll leave that out to go room temperature. I can't think of the words I was thinking of then. Now where's that bag? So I'll just show you what I'm talking about. This is one of the big bags already pre-cut. What I got off Timo. I'm not sure of the price I paid. I don't know if it was eleven ninety nine or what. But these are too big. Really. I, these are 100 pieces. 20 centimetres by 30. But they're too big. Too big for me. That way is alright. But this is too big. So what I'm going to do. I'm going to put two of these in the bottom. I'll put two of them in. Because there's only usually two of you for tea. And if there was more, I could just take them out. These are there full of... Oh, oh God, I oh, look like I've slipped my throat. Look at that. Uh, these are full of barbecue sock. To get off. Yeah. Full of barbecue sauce, and I will say, oh, for fairy's sake, I will say, look at that, it looks like a bleeding blood, but blood back in here. It's only barbecue, ch Chinese barbecue sauce. So, see where I've done that. Now, I'll show you what I mean. I pushed them to the bottom. I'll do that, I'll seal that. I have to pause this. I had to wash all that here. Barbecue sauce off them. So I've just done this one. Now I've sealed that across there. There's the barbecues there. So I've got two in the bottom. So if I wanted to you if I Will I I'm in the entry. If I wanted to use it, I cut it this end and get them out there. And then you've still got these up there. But I'm going to put two more up this end because I don't want to waste a whole bag like that just on doing the one thing. God, if anyone's squeamish, if that Doc Martin's watching, he'd be fainting now. It looks like blood. And it isn't. It's barbecue, Chinese barbecue sauce. Oh, God, I can't even open it. I do no good on, the on a cookery channel, me, would I? Can't even get this open. Just had a lady ask me to show it. How do I so that bag still got all this space? So I'm gonna put another, if I can, two in up the other end. Put two in there. I'm going to freeze that again, but I'm going to wipe that off first. See, I'm going to seal that across there. Lid down, press the boat sides, press both sides and press seal. And that's them. I've got two there and two in there. And I'm still here, upside down. Now there's four in there. Now I haven't vacuumed them. I have not vacuumed them. But no air can get at them now. So I'm going to freeze them anyway. Like they are. The way they are. If I find the drawer that's empty. Yeah. I'll put that in there. Now if I want to vacuum seal it. Oh my word. 
parents, except his parents, except the science expert of being here to have a field day thinking of being a murder. I was here like that after they done that, didn't I? So I'm going to show you now. I'll get my scissors and cut that to what I want. You cut this to whatever size you think you want. But I'm going to vacuum these to just show you. So you need extra room. Because you've got to leave about a good two or three inches. This is a bag I've made, don't forget, out of a reel. I, I prefer the reels, but... I'm going to send for more bags, but I know now not to get 20 by 30. I'm just going to put one in here. Oh my God, what a light colour of them. I've got Chinese sauce. Squash that out. I hope I can show you this, the way I'm doing it. I'm just going to do one. So bloody hard when that stuff's gone on the end. Don't know if I can get at it not to show you. Look. See there's just one and you've got to leave a good space there. So I'll try and do this with one hand and I'm gonna press Moist. I'm going to press that what says moist. hasn't really uh, took it out as much as I wanted it to and I did press the moist so the, the seal stopped flashing now got to wait till it turns off I do not like doing this this way I'm telling you now <laughs> stop flashing but that hasn't done the uh, seal, it has sealed it, but it hasn't took the vacuum out what I wanted to do. I'll have another go. That's it. I do think the seal part is going on my, um, <coughs> on my machine, but I, I, I only paid £15, £15.99 for this years ago. I might treat myself to a new one. Um, I might have a look in a minute at them and see what's what. But I don't like filming this way, I'm telling you now. I don't know where I'm looking. I know the camera's there. So I try to look there, but I'm looking in the middle because I'm seeing myself. <laughs> so let's have another go at it. Just want to do one again and see so i've sealed that end of the reel let this one open try and get this in with that bloody bloodbath everywhere wish they'd make it a gadget but you put that in and it keeps the top open and i haven't seen one if they've got already got them I don't, i've never seen one around Buying these again. <laughs> the white top. I 
I might as well stick two under. I don't think there'll be a lot of you turning this one off for blood. Which it isn't blood, it's barbecue sauce. And I went to the uh, I had to go to the doctors this morning. The diabetic nurse, because I got my blood took the other week, didn't I? And she said to me, yeah, 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 I'm managing it well. So she said, out of all me, me diabetes patients, I'm a favourite because she said I look I I do what she tells me. I follow the rules sort of cutting out tins. I never have only really cut out like white tins, like white bread, white potatoes, white rice. I've only cut them things out for that. <gasps> God forensic science. I mean forensic detectives. I'll try this once more. I hope it works. I'll try that a little bit more and see. Might have been too wet at the end. But it, <coughs> I couldn't be without one of these now. Because as I say, I made scouts last week. And I froze three. And then I made pea soup and I froze three of them. Well, let's see if this will do it this time. Yeah, no. That's, that sucked it out of it that time. What it didn't do before. And it stop, stops them getting their freezer bin in them. When you put them in the freezer. And then I've got a little thing, labels, what I've got off Timo as well. See, that sucked the air out of that one. I've got these labels. I've got them off Timo, so I just label it what it is, Chinese barbecue, and then I stick it on. Stick it on them. I'll, I'll have to put one under one in the fridge, in the freezer. And then... Um, <clears throat> I know what's what then. My God, there's bloody loads of. So how many did I get? There's the one in that. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, eleven pieces. I must have got because he had two before. Oh, and a, a little tip, by the way. Um, <clears throat> if you're doing them in an air fryer, wrap them in foil first. Cause I don't mind. In, on, I put foil on the air tray and then I put the, the chicken on. But with the barbecue, it's it started burning quick. Chinese. I mean, with the Chinese barbecue. I'll just write on that. And I'll write on this one. Chinese. Get used to that good and predicted tech, don't you? Filling that in for you. I'm waiting for it to finish. How we spell Chinese here? And I forget it doesn't do it. Got me. So it's now October, isn't it? I will put October 24 as well because I've got quite a few things in there now in the freezer. OCT 24. Yeah, so I'll just stick that on. So I'll just stick that like that. I'll find somewhere for them to go. Uh, and as I say, <coughs> this this machine, <coughs> I'm gonna go online after I've been on here. Me, the, the these things, them, these are sticking. When, it, when I've stored it for a bit, they're sticking. So you've still got them to, to back. So I'll leave that for now. Um, I've showed you what I wanted to show you, and I've showed the lady what I did. I hope. I hope I have anyway. Um, but
but you can freeze anything. You see, I've 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 chopped when my hands have been good. I've chopped carrots up because John does it all for me, uh, and then I bag it all and I uh, vacuum pack them and put them in the freezer so they're ready. Say I want scouse or soup or anything, carrot and turnip for the roasting and that. Uh, it's ready done and I just cut it and put it in the pan, it's ready to cook. So I tend to do that, but I'd be lost without it because you can use it for absolutely anything. Even if I've got, say I've got mashed potato and I've got minced mash and sausage and I've cooked them and they're over, got some over. Sooner than waste it, I, I'll put the gravy in the bottom with the sausage and then I'll put the mash on the top and then I'll, I'll just seal it like I have with the other nut. Not suck the vacuum out, I'll just seal it. But the, and, and then, because it all goes down the same hole, doesn't it, when you're eating it? So who cares? I, I, even if cabbage in it, it all goes down the same way. So I don't like wasting food, so I do that. And it saved me a bomb, because being on my own, I throw a hell of a lot out. Well, I don't now, but I used to. But I'm going to definitely look for a new one of these. Hope you like this anyway. Uh, I've got nothing more to tell you, have I? No. Bird's been back. Been back for this food. Yeah, no, he's been back for more. So I'm going to go over and out now. Nice speaking to you all again. Thank you for doing all you do. What are you on about? Don't know. You know what I mean, don't you? Over and out. Bye for now. Love you all. I'm not kissing me hand because I wasn't that stuff.